Hi there, and welcome to the ISO 15189-2022 training course. Think of this as your go-to guide for making sense of medical laboratory standards. We know how overwhelming these requirements can seem, so we've designed this course to break everything down into clear, actionable steps. Whether you're a lab manager, a quality professional, or part of a team working toward accreditation, we're here to help you navigate the process with confidence and take your lab operations to the next level. Don't worry. Getting ISO 15189 accreditation doesn't have to be stressful or complicated. In this course, we'll break everything down and guide you step by step through the 2022 standard. We'll focus on real, practical strategies that you can actually use in your lab. Our goal? To help you not just tick boxes, but to truly shine, delivering accurate, reliable results that build trust. Let's work together to make compliance a tool for excellence, not a burden. Why does ISO 15189 accreditation matter? It's not just about meeting requirements. It's about building trust, improving precision, and driving excellence. Accreditation sets your lab apart, showing your commitment to quality, patient safety, and regulatory compliance. This course will help you achieve all of that with practical tools and strategies to make implementation manageable and effective. This course is designed to take you step by step through the key chapters of ISO 15189-2022, ensuring that you understand each requirement and how to implement it effectively in your laboratory. Let's break it down. Introduction to ISO 15189-2022. We'll start by looking at the overall purpose and scope of the standard. You'll gain a clear understanding of why ISO 15189 is crucial for medical laboratories. This includes its role in ensuring quality, competence, and trust in the healthcare sector. Whether you're new to the standard or refreshing your knowledge, this foundation sets the stage for everything we'll cover. Chapter 4, General Requirements. In this chapter, we focus on two critical principles, impartiality and confidentiality. Impartiality, how can your lab demonstrate fairness in all processes, from sample testing to result reporting? Confidentiality, we'll explore practical ways to ensure patient information is handled securely in compliance with regulatory requirements. These are the building blocks for establishing credibility and trust in your lab's operations. Chapter 5, Structural Requirements. This section dives into the organizational framework necessary for compliance. You'll learn how to define clear roles and responsibilities within your lab. We'll also discuss creating a structure that supports authority, accountability, and seamless operations. This ensures that everyone on your team understands their part in meeting ISO 15189 requirements. Chapter 6, Resource Requirements. Every lab relies on qualified personnel and proper infrastructure. In this chapter, we'll cover staff competencies, what qualifications and training are essential for your team to perform their duties accurately. You'll also learn how to evaluate and maintain the physical resources, such as equipment and facilities, that are critical for producing reliable results. This chapter is all about ensuring that your lab is equipped to deliver quality services consistently. Chapter 7, Process Requirements. And th this is where we get into the nitty gritty of your lab's daily operations. We'll guide you through every stage of the laboratory process, from sample handling and method validation to test result reporting. The goal here is to ensure consistency, transparency, and accuracy in all your processes, which is key to building trust with patients and stakeholders. Chapter 8, Management System Requirements. A robust management system is the backbone of any successful lab. In this chapter, we'll explain how to implement effective internal audits, handle corrective actions, and drive continual improvement. These steps ensure your lab not only meets ISO 15189 requirements, but also sustains excellence over the long term, monitoring and continual improvement. Finally, 
we'll focus on creating systems to track and improve your lab's performance. You'll learn how to set up effective monitoring tools to measure your lab's outcomes. We'll also cover strategies for identifying areas for improvement and making changes that lead to sustained success. By the end of this course, you'll have a complete understanding of ISO 15189-2022, along with the practical tools to implement it. And don't forget, the downloadable resources include a checklist of requirements, a list of necessary documents, and ready-to-use templates to make the process even easier. Let's dive in together and make ISO 15109 work for you. This isn't just another theory-heavy course. We've packed it with practical tools to help you succeed every step of the way. Video tutorials. We'll walk you through each ISO 15109 requirement in a way that's simple and easy to follow. No unnecessary jargon here. Checklists. Downloadable guides to keep you on track as you implement the standard in your lab. Template previews. You'll get a sneak peek at some of the customizable templates for policies, procedures, and forms. If you need the full set, those are available for purchase separately. Interactive quizzes. At the end of each module, you can test your knowledge and identify any areas that need a little more focus. We've designed these resources to make your ISO 15189 journey as smooth and straightforward as possible, while giving you the flexibility to expand your toolkit when you're ready. Let's talk about what you'll get for your investment. For just $89 for a limited time only, you'll gain lifetime access to this comprehensive course, which includes all the tools and resources we've just discussed. A certificate of completion to showcase your expertise. This is a small price to pay for the long-term benefits of mastering ISO 15189 and elevating your lab's performance. ISO 15189 is more than a standard it's a tool to build trust, enhance precision, and demonstrate excellence in patient care. This course gives you everything you need to competently implement the standard and achieve accreditation. Don't wait. Take the next step today. We're here to guide you every step of the way.